bonjour, namaste, ni hao, and ohio, everybody. What is going on, Gail right here? Welcome back to the YouTube channel once again for another Don Machi video. And well, today, well, actually, I should say today, two hours later after the Should You Summon video, I wasn't expecting to be dropping this video as well, to be quite honest. Um, I thought I was done for the day. Tomorrow evening, we would do the Should You Summon, and I can go from there. But turns out, uh, Damachi had something else in store for me and as you can see by the title already uh, They stealth dropped well I don't say stealth dropped because they literally pinged everybody in the discord But uh, they decided to announce that there was going to be a closed beta test for the new Danmachi Battle Chronicle game in March And they have announced that registration is now live from the 5th of January up until the 10th of March. So they're giving us enough time to register and do all the shenanigans that we want to. So if I were to go and quickly use uh, the help of uh, DeepL, we're gonna quickly just translate this as you guys can see right here. Um, so of course, uh, one of the things uh, they've announced is obviously the participation has started. Prior to the official release, we will conduct a closed beta test for the purpose of adjusting the game balance and server load verification. We will strive to further improve the quality towards the official release in reference to the opinions and impressions of the customers who's participated so please cooperate with us check the website for more details now this is something that a lot of gacha games do actually funnily enough um, during my reaction or in my reaction video uh, there was a comment asking me about a closed beta test and I had no answers because I didn't know when it was gonna happen but Turns out they are actually one step ahead of the game and they know that there was going to be a closed beta test because here we are now uh, with an official closed beta test. But um, this indicates to me that the game is going to launch probably in and around May is my guess because I think that with the beta test going from the 16th of March to the 22nd of March, I do believe they'll take about a month at the very least to prepare the game and get it ready. I mean, if you look at past beta tests and past closed beta tests we've had in other games, Sword Art Online Variant Showdown, uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! Cross Duel, these are recent ones. And then if you look even further back with games like Genshin and stuff like that, from my understanding is that it's usually been a month to a month and a half for the game to go from closed beta to actually launching to the public. So. In my eyes, this is probably going to be at least a May release minimum. Uh, there is a chance it can come out in April, but I think May is more likely. So I'm very excited for it. Of course, there uh, there is going to be a PV again tomorrow at the GA Fest uh, 2023, which is going to include a lot of different things. It's going to include Danmachi, Goblin Slayer stuff and other things. But I think their focus is going to be on Danmachi because of the 10th anniversary, right? So I expect it to be the same PV. I don't expect it to be any different, to be quite honest. So don't expect any new PV or new content or new trailer uh, things at, at all. Don't expect anything there. But uh, this is going to be very exciting. I'm very, very much uh, excited to see what they're going to do. Um, let's go over to the website now. So this is the website. Um, you have to go to Danmachi. Uh, hyphen dantro.com slash cbt slash um, I'm gonna put the link in the description so you guys can easily register but for example if I wanted to register I would just say get right seven at gmail.com and I would just click this button well if it I, I have to probably refresh because I was just testing it out with my personal email ID um, so I would do gale riot 7 at gmail.com and I would just click this uh, it would basically say um, application completed. Your application has been received. Please check that an email notification has been sent to the email address you enter to confirm that your application has been successful. And I've just checked my phone. I have gotten the application. So you can actually get it. Of course, there are other requirements and suggestions. Like, for example, uh, this tells you exactly what sort of memory and device you would need for your phone So an iPhone 8 plus or later or an Android 8 or later phone it has to be 64-bit compatible So even if you're playing on an emulator It's very likely you will need to get the latest blue stacks or latest Nox device or something like that in order to play it It's not gonna be easy to play whatsoever. I don't think so that's also there There's only gonna be a limit of 3,000 participants So fingers crossed I can get in because I can create content for you guys um, um, and obviously if you guys don't mind I'm gonna ask this right away if you do get it please let me know because I might actually offer you to uh, give me the account if possible or give me access to it for recording purposes and stuff if you get in of course but don't worry I hope I can get in I'm not expecting um, 
I'm, I'm expecting to get in. I usually with closed beta tests, I've been lucky enough to get into various ones. I got into Yu-Gi-Oh's one, and I got into uh, SAO's very SAO variant showdowns one. So, fingers crossed this works out. I it could also go wrong terribly. It could also go wrong terribly. So, um, it seems like well, it'll go on to our Google Play account. You can access it from uh, the Gmail. There will be test flight, of course, if you are on Apple. So, a couple of different things. I do assume that it's going to try and they're gonna try and limit it to people playing in Japan only. But yeah, if it, you know, if we can get around it, you know, through VPN services or whatever, or maybe a Japanese account, which I uh, do have access to, um, it may become, it may make our lives easier. But let's see, let's see what happens. But yes, uh, the closed beta test servers are live. I'm gonna be covering it, even if I don't get in. I'll try and cover it through other people's recordings and stuff. Um, hopefully I can uh, get in it will make life a lot easier but there you guys have it that's a little bit of small information it wasn't gonna be a long video anyways because there's I, I had to just check how long it was because I was just like this is this is not gonna be a long video but I had to obviously make a video talking about this because I'm super super excited for the closed beta test and uh, obviously I know as an English player it's very unlikely that we're going to be able to easily access it but nonetheless it's hype I'm very excited we're still two and a half months away from the actual beta test though so we have more than enough time to prepare for it but yeah thank you guys so much for watching bit of a short video but hopefully i could uh you know detail out a lot of uh, information for you guys and uh hopefully i see you guys playing the game in about a couple of months time thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys next time take it easy every bye bye